Arthon, Longwood Gardens in Costa Rica. All that and more on today's RHS Morning Show. Go Ridley! Good morning, Ridley. I'm Iris, and joining me today is Ali. Today is Tuesday, November 12th, 2024, and we're on the white schedule. Arthon is holding a fundraiser tomorrow from 4 to 8 p.m. at Chipotle. Visit the home's location during these hours to support the group's fundraising efforts for the Children's Hospital of Pennsylvania. 25% of the event sales will be donated to the cause. Late registration for AP exams is open until this Friday, November 15th. The cost per exam during this period is $104. Payments can be handled via school pay, cash, or money order made pay payable to Ridley High School. Any questions can be directed to the school counseling office. The World Cultures and Languages Club, Engineering Club, and Gang Green are hosting a trip to Longwood um, Gardens on Friday, January 3rd. Permission slips can be picked up from Ms. Denton in room A206 or Ms. Whelan and C303. Those are due back by December 10th with the $33 payment for admission and the bus. Attention all current sophomores and juniors. There are still a number of open spots on the Spring Break 2026 tour to the tropical paradise of Costa Rica. Stop by B203 and see Mr. Seymour for information on how to enroll in this once-in-a-lifetime trip to one of the most beautiful countries on the planet. Enroll in the next two weeks for an extra $200 early enrollment discount. Today on the tray is your choice of rice bowl or burrito. We'd like to thank you for watching the RHS Morning Show. It's educational television. It's educational because we are learning. Have a great day, Ridley. This is Ms. Pickett, the librarian here at Ridley High School. And today I'm featuring a true crime story that is one of the nominees for the Pennsylvania Reader's Choice Award in the teen category. Accountable by Dashka Slater. What would you do if you came across an inflammatory social media account that one of your friends had created? Would you follow, like, or comment on the edgy post? What if you found out that pictures of your classmates had been posted on the feed? What if it was a picture of you? When a racist, misogynist Instagram account was discovered in Albany, California in 2017, these were just a few of the questions that the school community needed to answer. Charles, a Korean American high school junior, had posted degrading, threatening memes featuring girls of color from his school. One image even depicted a classmate and a noose. The exposure of this account set off a series of events that included accusations, protests, mediation attempts, expulsions, lawsuits, and other ongoing ripple effects in the aftermath. This eye-opening true crime story will have readers questioning what it means to truly hold someone accountable. If accountable sounds interesting to you, stop by the library to check it out. <laughs> 